In the sixth month, the angel Gabriel was sent by God to a town in Galilee called Nazareth to a virgin engaged to a man whose name was Joseph of the house of David. The virgin's name was Mary. And he came to her and said, Greetings, favored one. The Lord is with you. But she was much perplexed by his words and pondered what sort of greetings this might be. The angel said to her, Do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found favor with God. And now you will conceive in your womb and bear a son, and you will name him Jesus. He will be great and will be called the Son of the Most High, and the Lord God will give to him the throne of his ancestor David. He will reign over the house of Jacob forever, and of his kingdom there will be no end. Mary said to the angel, How can this be, since I am a virgin? The angel said to her, The Holy Spirit will come upon you, and the power of the Most High will overshadow you. Therefore, the child to be born will be holy. He will be called Son of God. To carry a dream is to walk at night, or to walk by light, but with a pebble in your shoe. To carry a dream is to wake at night, to wake and blink twice in case you see something new. To carry a dream is to plant trees in old age, to be part of a church that is human and frayed. To carry a dream is foolish and wild. It's the faith of a child wishing on stars. But to carry a dream is also hopeful and wise. The faith of our elders saying God will provide. So may we walk until we see the light. May the pebble in our shoe remind us why we fight. May they say we are foolish and unwise, and may we continue to dream. May our hope keep us alive.
This concludes our Tuesday mini-concert series. At this moment, I would like to thank you for your dedication and support since mid-March. We are going to take a break from the concerts for a few weeks while we are working on an exciting new program the mu Music Ministry will launch in the new year. Stay tuned for the updates. <laughs>